Hello everybody, it's me, your favorite Giraffe Factor Rain, and we're playing some Neo Scavenger. And, uh, yeah. Happy Monday, by the way. But, uh, well, for those of you who watch these the day they come out, but I am actually in the past right now, from you. Except that I'm on your screen right now, so I guess I'm in the present? Speaking from the past. Hello from the past. It's okay that you did that thing. Don't worry about it. <laughs> but, uh... I'm recording these uh, episodes for this week all in one all in one go because I'm out of town right now, but uh, I will be back um, next week. I just thought you guys should know, you know, like get to know you guys a little bit better by letting you get to know me. So I will. Uh, so these episodes might seem like might be like a little bit more contiguous, I guess. Um, so it might like seem a little weird, and I just wanted to kind of get them out of the way because I am going to be uh, traveling uh, this weekend, or you know, yesterday, as it were for you, and I'll be uh, kind of busy and in the non-internet zone for a week. So I just wanted to get these recorded and get them out to you guys. Um, but yeah, so let's get back to surviving. Um, what have we got here? We just we found out how to make tea, right? We made tea, and what else? We want to figure out how to make uh, what arrows? Arrows. Uh, I think I think I remember. So I I think I know what I did wrong. Um, okay, here we go. So tree branch. Or we'll take the one that already has stuff off of it. Um, tree branch and some sharp edge, right? Something sharp, so shards there. Uh, we took scraps of paper, I think. We're going to need... We are obviously going to need... What you call it? What am I trying to say? Oh, ranged there. Um... And I thought that was what we needed, but... Oh yeah, we need string, of course, as well, I think. Pretty sure. And small parts, I think, is the thing that was missing last time. Please? No. Damn it. Maybe we just need, like, more string or more paper? <laughs> Damn it. I could have sworn I remembered how to do this. Here, let's get more paper scraps out to do this with. Oh, okay. Well, fuck. <laughs> We just needed we actually just needed more paper. That's fine. So let's keep let's just make a few of these, yeah? Oh, okay, and that's you can't make any more? Fine. I see how it is. So I guess we can't really Well, here. We can make some more paper scraps out of that newspaper. Oh, oh <laughs> duh. We ran out of uh branches. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, clear. Not enough moves. That's fine. All right, so we'll wait and go back. And I want to make, I want to make as many as our like we can carry in our bow. You know, right? So, or like I guess in one stack is the answer to our dilemma. And because we really want to have, we want to be safe, right? So I think having a ranged weapon with easily. Uh, with, with easily replaced ammo is the best way. And so the fact that we were able to get this compound bow is pretty fantastic. So we'll get... We'll take these branches. Oh, we might be out of glass shards, too. Oh, no, not yet. Alright. And range and uh, string? We need string, right? Uh, oh, parts, parts. We need parts. And string. Small string? Don't we add a small string? Hey. There we go, yeah. We'll undo that other small string, or this other medium thread, too. Whoops, oh, I did that backwards. Yeah, and... Nope, not that one. Where's... No, what? Why can't I undo this one? Damn it, okay. So, you might notice that there are two kinds of arrows here. Um, one is a piercing arrow, and one is a broadhead arrow. And from what I understand, they're both 
they're both good, but broadheads do a little bit more, like, cause a little bit more damage on the spot, and I think that might do us a little bit better right now. Um, yeah, so we'll do that. Anyway, so let's try to just make as many of these broadheads as we can. Okay, uh, oh, that one didn't go into a stack, so we might, that might be all we want to carry. Yeah, because we can't really carry any more than that if we can't fit. Yeah, so that last one we don't need. I think we can uncraft it, actually. Yeah, confirm. Clear. All right, and now let's get everything that we want stacked up and taken away. Oh, we already have some, some of that. Uh, we've got tea and everything. Let's get these scraps of paper. We need those. I don't, I don't want this this one anymore. Get out of here. Uh, we'll take our strings, please. Actually, I kind of want to uncraft that. Gonna uncraft that one. Clear. Get in here. Put it away like that. Oh, there's some more. Where did we get this small animal hide? When did this happen? Oh, we cut up a guy and ate him, right? Okay. Uh, some shards. I think we had those in our pocket. So we'll put it there. And is that everything? I think that's everything. Looks like everything. That paper is useless, so... Alright, cool. Now let's keep on searching around this area. The fact that we're myopic doesn't make it easy, but uh, we do have, I mean, we've got, we've got uh, magnifying optics on, so we basically have the same view as a normal person right now. It's like we have to hide two sets of tracks. Oh, no, it's, we are hiding two sets of tracks, I think. There are plenty of people here. Okay, so we'll scavenge around here first. Let's go to an abandoned house fleeing urban centers in search of supplies and supernatural threats encroaching from the wilds. The suburbs became the... The suburbs were hit hard in the collapse, with masses of people fleeing urban centers in search of supplies and supernatural threats encroaching from the wilds. The suburbs became the front lines of in a war for survival. Still, houses like these are so numerous that they that some have been entirely missed by scavengers, and they tend to be less likely to fall over than bigger buildings in urban centers. Neato. So we'll do our triple threat there. Pretty good. Confirm. And we still alerted creatures. Fantastic. Okay, um, how's our bag doing? 80? These bags kind of suck. I really wish that we had... Oh, okay, uh, well, screw it. We'll, we'll get we'll get the second one done. I wish we had a backpack. I'm really looking forward to having a backpack, because the backpacks don't fall apart nearly as quickly. Alright, we'll hold on to those strings. This monkey wrench... Oh, it's broken, so it's useless. We'll take this other, we'll take this bottle. That's fine. I uh, want we'll to keep it right there. Yeah, we still got plenty of room, so that's good. Very, very good. All right, cool. Let's. Nothing else. Okay, nothing else. Cool. Whatever. Let's move on. Um don't really want to talk to that guy, so I'm going to try to avoid him. Please don't talk to us. We will end you. Uh, here, that's what we want. All right, hide our tracks. Keep moving. Hide our tracks. Hide, and... Oh, it's getting dark out? Damn it. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. Where's... Where are we? So we're kind of... I think we should kind of try to clear out the map, so we'll go down this way, I think, and then we'll try to search this area too. But I think if we kind of kind of try to clear out this spot here, go t down towards some of that spot that we've already seen, I think that'll be good. Oh, whoops. Okay. Oh, good. It's raining. 
it's, it's pretty marshy out here, so maybe maybe we're on the right track. Uh, maybe we should hide in this cabin. Hide and turn. Scavenge this place. Oh, it's just a stretch of forest. Huh. I'll use botany. A strong hiding snare light. Wow, look at that. That's awesome. Nothing. And we hit uh, our butt. I don't know. We hit. We hurt something. Let's check out what we hit. N nothing. All right. Just kind of. Just kind of hurt. <laughs> Okay, whatever. All right, well, this place kind of sucked. Um, this is not a very good place to be, is it? Especially now that we alerted nearby things. Yep, yep, okay, well, darn. Our armor was barely affected. That kind of sucks that our armor was affected at all. Our dogman fur coat is doing quite well, though, so that's all that matters. No turns, okay. Hmm. Dude's feeble, barefoot, blind, and punching. So I'm just gonna shoot him. Let's see, stranger takes cover. Dang it. Dude took cover. Uh. I think I actually need to switch to the rifle butt. And sneak towards. Stranger flees blindly. I'll offer to talk. It'll expose me, but... Oh, okay, well, they retreated. That's fine. Well, we're gonna hide. End our turn. Um, I don't really know what else we can do. We can walk around in the dark, but that's not a great idea. We're gonna do it anyway. <laughs> okay, hide our tracks. End our turn. Let's go south here. End that turn. I'll hide these tracks for the morning. I'm pretty sure we need to go... It doesn't really tell you where you are, but I think we're right about he uh, here? Yeah, I think that's a new, a new place. So that means when the day comes, we should be able to... What's out here? Just some woods? Let's scavenge in the woods tonight. Strong, hiding, light, beautiful. Great, we alerted nearby creatures. Oh, well, we got two squirrels. That's kind of cool. I was mostly doing it for, like, berries and mushrooms, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to just chow down on berries and mushrooms. Okay. Edible mushrooms here. Beautiful. Botany is a really, really, really useful skill. We're going to take this... Oh, here we go. Some pieces of old newspaper with Apocalypse Now as the title. An outbreak of what appears to be smallpox has infected 28 people in Charleston, South Carolina. Head of health officials said Wednesday. Oh, <laughs> whoops. <laughs> Still the same sentence. I can't read today, apparently. Four people have died. With such a contagious disease and vaccines in short supply, more fatalities are expected. Scientists are scrambling to determine how the disease, believed to be eradicated in 1980, has infected the general population again. And more puzzling, why, are, why all reported cases thus far are concentrated in this seaside city? That is a good question. Some bad shit went down in this world. Oh, these are more edible berries. I'll eat them. Especially since we shouldn't hang out here. We should move on. Hello? You, you want to talk to me again? Are you serious? Oh, we wasted an arrow, didn't we? So we should probably make another one. Mm, yeah, we'll do it. We'll do it this turn. That's okay. Okay, crafting... Where's our... Where'd that newspaper go? There it is. Take my scraps from that. This. Where's our... Shard. String. We need parts. Uh, and ranged, right? And that should be it? Yep. Boom. Clear. And that should have been our whole turn. 
and that's it. That's all we need. Okay, now if that guy wants to talk to us, it's his problem because we are ready for him. Because we're already hiding, right? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I don't think you want to talk to us, mister. In fact, I know that's that guy, so... Yeah. Whoa, hey, he's got a friend now. That's not cool. Okay, we'll get out our, uh, get out our crude broadheads and move this way. Because I know for a fact that these flat areas give you a, uh, give you a really large, um, like, starting distance from enemies. Let's try to keep exploring this area. Hide those tracks. Hide and dead turn. There we go. That's much better. Okay, hide those tracks. Let's get up on this hill. Hide tracks. Damn. They know we're here, but they're probably too big of pansies to try to come get us. Oh, he really is trying to find us. Okay, that's not cool. Um, that's okay. We'll just try to fill out, fill out some of the map down here. I mean, if he finds us, he's dead. We can take him, I think. Yeah, we got our own arrows. That dude just had a uh, had a big stick. So, player's thirsty. That's okay. We will drink some tannin tea. Delicious, delicious tannin tea. Oh, I could have put away some. Whoops. Should have put away some uh, some water. We'll drink some tannin tea. Delicious. And get over here. Hide those tracks. Oh, we can search this center. It looks not as destroyed as most. Yeah, we'll go this way. Hide tracks. Didn't work. Awesome. Player's thirsty again. That's kind of dumb. And we're tired. Hide tracks. Hide. Scavenge, please. Abandoned apartment building. Hiding strong lighting. Confirm. Found stuff. What we find? Ooh, cornicola. Nice. Actual cornicola. Ooh, lots of amoxicillin. Aqua pur water purification tablets. We'll empty those and we'll keep them with us. Let's just put some pills on our sled. <laughs> Alright, um, how much amoxicillin do we have? Not tons. So let's see if we can fit those in there. Yep, beautiful. And awesome. We can empty out this one, combine those, and our second bottle of painkillers is filling up pretty quick. Take those back. Ooh, a whiskey ball. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> Tunnel people. The second housing collapse in as many years in as many years. Oh, these, the writing on these is a little bit awkward sometimes. The second housing collapse in as many years sends people flack, flacking, <laughs> flocking to flood tunnels for shelter. Record numbers of beleaguered mortgagers are seeking shelter anywhere they can find it. Many are turning to ad hoc communities centered around abandoned infrastructure, including flood tunnels, metro stations, and transfer stations. Hmm. So the world really fell apart. It's pretty amazing. Take some extra parts. Yeah, we can take this third stack. We emptied those out. We want this cornicola for sure. Cornicola is really delicious. Uh, it gives you some, gets rid of your thirst, and it helps out with being tired for a little while, but then you crash. Um, actually, that might work in our favor if we drink that now. Yeah, see, so it boosts everything because you get, well, you get a little bit, a little bit sweaty because you get a caffeine high. So that works out. Um, that should take us until the night time. <clears throat> Excuse me. And if it doesn't, then we'll drink the second dose of it. And we should be okay, I think. Don't. You don't want to mess with me. Ugh, we really got to get another boot. Another tactical boot. Don't mess with me. You get out of here. Oh yeah, we're crashing. We're crashing. It's alright though. We can just drink the second one. Where'd it go? There it is. Use. Taste the corny refreshment. Alright, so we filled out this spot. Let's go check on this and then head up, I guess, and kind of loop around like that. Like up over 
the top. But we'll go down this way first. I gotta start hiding my tracks more. My tracks. Damn. Okay, it's getting it's getting dark now. We'll probably hide in one of these one of these centers if we can find a good camp in one of them. Is there a cabin here? A ruined bungalow. It's got decent concealment. Not the best. Let's go down to this one. There might be a good a, a building up here. Oh, no more turns. Okay. Okay, and we're crashing. That's that's good. It's a good thing because it's getting dark out. That's not good that there's a guy there. He looks like he has a gun too, which is not cool for us. Okay, we are hiding. Um, there's an abandoned IT office here with pretty good concealment, so I think we'll take it. We should scavenge first. Mm, let's go for the office building. Hiding strong lighting. Stuck in an opening. Shit. Trying to access a blocked room, you get stuck crawling through an opening in the debris. You managed to wriggle free again, but you lost quite a bit of time in the ordeal. Okay. So I wasn't able to get anything there. We can scavenge the storage shed too. Hiding strong lighting. Pretty pretty good combo. Okay, nothing here. I guess we might be getting close to the to the sprawl again. We're right here, I think. So yeah, I guess we are kind of close to the sprawl. Alrighty. Well, in that case, let's. Okay, we'll end our turn. Okay, now it's dusk. Let's open up our inventory. Oh look, some, some glass shards. Good, we need those. Alright, let's get out our sleeping bag and all of our noise traps. Go to our campsite. Which one has the better base stats? This one has less shelter, but that's not that important because we have a nice coat. Hey, come on now. Boom. Wow, look at that. That's actually pretty sick. Nice. Okay, and let's um, drink some water and then go to bed. Yeah, some tan and tea, in fact. Drink that water, and we'll have to cook up some more water soon. Yeah, in fact, we'll have to go scavenging uh, in the woods sometime soon. But for now, we should be able to sleep, and we're relatively safe. Our alertness is very high. Okay, couldn't fall asleep. That's all right. That's all right. We got all night to do this. Why is oh, there's someone there too. That's kind of messed up. Sleep. Come on now. Sleep. Damn it. Come on, sleep. Ah, oh, come on. Okay. Uh, maybe we should take some sleeping pills. Although I have a feeling that will uh, ruin our alertness. Uh, all right. Well, for real, we need to sleep. So, let's let's go ahead and take some. Do that shit out. Use destroy the bottle because we don't need it. Did I? Oh no! I think I accidentally abandoned our uh, clean rags somewhere. Whoops. My bad. All right. Let's try to sleep now. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Now that's a good rest. All right, now it's done, and we should get our stuff out of our campsite. So we don't want to just leave it around here. There we go. And let's go fill in these gaps. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, blind retreat. Yep. It's just some guy, but oh, he's a leader which means he has a group somewhere. Uh, hide our tracks, please. And then move and make more tracks, obviously, is the only course of action that makes any sense. Can I please move down here? There we go. Hide tracks. Didn't work. Okay. Okay, now they're gone. I doubt there's anything important in those three squares. Um. Wait, what? Did, we, did our thing break? I guess so. Well, that's not bad. That's that's not really a bad thing. Uh, we can make a new one in one turn here. 
use our turn up to do this. Handful of string, can, and some assorted small parts, right? Yeah. There. Confirm. We'll take that back. Okay, well, that's not a big deal. We've got three still, so... Oh, wait, what? Okay, so we also have another can of soup, so we'll make... We'll finish making a second one. Where's the parts we've already used? There they are. Okay. Some string and a can of soup. Confirm. Vehicle. Place them in there. And we'll take that back. We will eat that. We need to make some more water. Need to, yeah, need to, need to definitely fill up some water bottles. Okay, so let's start moving north here. Do not, you do not want to mess with me. Not out in the open like this, especially. Hide the tracks, man. Hide, end the turn. Weak with thirst. That's okay. We're going to get up here. We're going to grab some water. Well, we're going to go here, and we're going to grab some sticks. A bunch of sticks. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Ah, oh, man, there's so many people around here. Oh, he's got a crowbar. I kind of want a crowbar. Okay, uh, hide our tracks this is our number one, number one priority. This is a lot of people around here. Go in here, hide some tracks, and we just need to get, actually I wouldn't mind getting some, oh wow there's a lot of woods here, wouldn't mind getting some meat going as well. So strong hiding botany, squirrel snare light, <laughs> look at all those green bars. Awesome. We found a squirrel corpse. Oh, what do you mean a squirrel corpse can't fit in the plastic bag? That's that's not true. And you know it, video game. Hey, we even found some water in here. Convenient. Edible mushrooms. Beautiful. And a bunch of edible berries, which are really good for water. But you gotta eat a lot of them for them to matter. Okay, now we'll use that. And I don't really need these uh, these ashes. We're gonna t we're gonna take them anyway, I guess. Okay, wait. We gotta we gotta get organized. All right. Twigs and stuff we can fit. We can actually fit in our plastic bag, which is down to fifty percent. That's not great. Put that there. And let's go up to this water. Oh, no moves. Right. End turn. Go to this water, please. Hide those tracks. Hide. Scavenge a little bit. Might find some more uh, edibles here. I'll do hiding and botany. Because we might get something. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, now let's craft with the rest of our turn. Okay, so let's get some fire going. This episode has been a little bit uneventful, and I'm sorry for that, because it is, I mean, sometimes the game can be, like, a little bit boring, but I, I do honestly think it's, uh, I find it pretty captivating. Like, these half hours, they go by so fast to me. Okay, need to put water in there. Um, oh, we need to cut up the squirrel corpse, that's for sure. These half hours, they go by really quick because, like, they're just... This game is just so cool. Um, and, like, and it's so... It's so random sometimes. Like, you can't... Can't really predict what's gonna happen. And, uh, you may feel like you're safe. Like, I kind of feel like I'm safe. I got this compound bow. And, like, and these arrowheads and everything. Uh, that... These, these crude broadheads that we can make ourselves And, like... I feel like we're pretty set up at the moment with our skills and everything, but at the same time, we're just like simply surviving, right? Um, we're not really like making progress per se. We gotta, cause we gotta, we got a little bit of a grind, I think, before we can get back into the city, which kind of sucks. Um, yeah, but you know, what, what can you do, right? So let's see, we're gonna make, we're gonna make that meat there. And so now we've got a good deal of meat Oops, that's not what I meant. I meant that. There we go. Oh, we can make another. Uh, can make another glove. 
Oh, we are out of turns now, though. Okay, so, end that turn. You get out of here. You stay away from me. Alright. Um, oh, it's day now. That's good. Let's get this campfire. Water. I'm gonna purify a bunch of water. And... Uh, well, let's try to make this... Uh, let's try to make this... Um, animal bits into another glove. How did we do that last time? Did we have to use a cutting tool? Where are our cutting tools? Are there? Patchwork hide glove. Yeah. Sweet. Got our other glove. Put it on real quick. Bam. Nice. Good looking gloves. Uh, let's look at... Uh, it takes everything out every time you leave the screen. It's kind of annoying. Okay, water. We need our other soup can, please. Soup can. Botany. Bark. Beautiful. And let's make some tannin tea. And let's grab some more water. And we'll make some more tannin tea. This doesn't hurt. Uh, we've got plenty of water here. Um, so we don't need to worry about like we don't need to worry about having enough to store so we have we have three bottles with us right now so let's make another batch of tan and tea out of two more out of two more twigs uh, crafting make a little bit more tan and tea and we'll have to call it an episode wait what where's our water oh okay so we gotta get the water out well wait do it the smart way Okay, get the water, get the, damn it, that's more water, get, the, <laughs> get the, the soup can, the fire, the botany, and the bark. Boom. There, tannin tea, all for days. Um, we can make some more tannin tea for ourselves. And we'll drink up that stuff. Uh, so we've got plenty of stuff. We're getting set up here for more adventuring out in the wild, trying to find some more, trying to find some more stuff. Yeah. But um, for now, I'm gonna have to say that's an episode, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.